Hey everyone, thank you for watching. It is Crypto Plumber. Last weekend, I built this room in my office. Uh, it is approximately 10 feet by about, I want to say about seven, uh, maybe six and a half inches. And behind this door is my mining room in a pressure, stable, and very cold environment. Uh, I'm going to show you what what that looks like right now. First thing you will see is I have two thermostats. One's reading 36, the other one's reading 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Here are my miners. Eight ant miner S9s. I have additional 10 on the way. I have spare parts, control boards, gadget cards, and fans. Waiting on a couple power supplies. So this fan, this exhaust fan, is a 5500 cubic foot CFM per minute exhaust. Uh, this window here is open. I got a couple filters in front of them. And listen, guys, the air coming out of here is cool. It's a little warm, but it's cool. So in theory, I'm standing right here and it's cold. So in theory, what you're seeing here is air being sucked out of this window and through the mine, I mean through the exhaust fan. I am going to have fabricated some ductwork and we're gonna take this upper window here and that size, I'm gonna slope up and across here till here. And here and here, here and there, I'm going to have uh, cutouts for grills. But instead of grills, I'm going to have uh, filters that can be slid in and out to filter the air. Not like these cheap disposable $1 filters, but I'll have a thicker filter. And the air then is going to be forced out of these two, across the room, and out the exhaust. Now, each miner uses a uh, has a certain amount of CFM that it actually draws across and out, as well as the power supplies. But this is the intake, and this is the exhaust side. And the idea is you really want to keep this room as quiet as possible, as, uh, not sorry, as cool as possible, temperature-wise, to uh, have the miners uh, happy. Well, you know, I don't really be happy, but you know, the cooler they are, the more I wouldn't say efficient they are, but the, you know, the longer they will last. And what's also very important is about every month or so, we got to shut them down, take them apart, take out the hashing cards, and with an air compressor, blow them all out. Because as you can see, I do have some dust built up on these, and not a lot but there is some dust accumulation on them. I'm just gonna wipe them off right now because I'm gonna check these, to get these again on Sunday. It's now Friday. I wanna check them again on Sunday and see what the dust level is then on top of them. Cause I could have, yeah, we had some, uh, we got some dust on there. We're gonna have to take these apart uh, probably this weekend. Clean out the hashing cards, make sure everything is, uh, good work in the water and clean. Obviously I'm still getting some dirt and dust in there, but we have to address that. Uh, guys, I hope you like this video. If you haven't already, uh, please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up, write a comment, let me know what you guys think, any questions. Uh, I am a plumber and I'm also an expert in HVAC. I know about negative and positive air pressure and I know about CFM and what it's gonna take to cool these and the additional 10 for a total of 18 I'm gonna have in the next couple months. They've already been ordered from Bitmain. They'll be here hopefully sooner than what they call March batch. So, like I said, if you haven't already, uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, get notifications when I do post a new video. It's almost on a daily basis. Uh, give me your thoughts and comments in the comment field below and give me a th thumbs up. Uh, that's it, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great weekend and happy new year.